everybody welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Debbie this is my crafty Dan and I have a Dollarama haul of course for you let's do food first I don't have much food I grabbed two bottles of cranberry juice it's the ocean spray I love this stuff this is the diet 10 calories per a cup which isn't bad. I was getting the other kind. Like that's, I mean, you're just drinking your calories then. There's one gram of sugar, a diet low calorie beverage. So that's all it says on the front. But this is the one that I get at the grocery store too. And this is a little bit cheaper. So this is $1.50 and you can return the bottles here too. I like that you can recycle by returning your bottles and getting part of your deposit back. So the other thing I got, of course, I stocked up, <laughs> I stocked up guys on my Island bar, chocolate bars. These are just a mound of coconut covered in chocolate. If you like coconut, these things are awesome. And you get two bars for a dollar. And there are actually three small bars in each package. I love these things. And as I was just going out the till, I remembered I needed a loaf of bread. So I grabbed a loaf of Wonder Bread. I grabbed two bottles of water. These are the one and a half liter bottles of water. These are $1.25 a piece. I don't have running water here in the camper. I have to go into the house to get some. I've been keeping a couple of bottles of these in the little fridge here in the camper so that I have something to drink at night and I don't have to go in and bother them. And while I was there, I grabbed one bottle of the citrus amp. If this is in the cold cooler, just as you check out is a dollar 25. My son loves this stuff. That's the only thing he drinks besides water and coffee. So I grabbed a, a can of that for him. I'll take that into the house for him in a minute. This is, this is cold. I threw it in my fridge so it'd still be cold when I took it into him. And for my kitty, I grabbed a bag of whiskers. So I know how people say don't buy your pet foods at the Dollarama because they're not good. There's poison in them. There's, <laughs> um, I've read it all, but guys, this whiskers is the only thing that my cat will eat. I can put other cat food down for her. I've tried the expensive brands, the inexpensive brands, everything. You're supposed to vary your pet's diet because it's supposed to be healthier for them and keep things more exciting for them. My cat hates everything but this whiskers. And I buy it at the grocery store anyway. This little bag, 670 grams, is only 350. She doesn't eat a lot. She's, she's not a big eater, but this is the only thing that she'll eat. I wanted to stock up on some personal care items for here at the camper instead of taking stuff back and forth every time I go. So I grabbed a pack of these gum brand dental floss sticks, flossing sticks. I grabbed a package of those. These were $3.50. I don't know if that's a good buy or not, but it was just convenient for me to get them there. So I grabbed them. I picked up a package of the fluffs cotton pads just these rounds you know the i like using these to clean my nails when i have nail polish on them they're a hundred for a dollar 25 so not bad i picked up a package of cotton swabs 350 for a dollar 25 they had larger packs there too I'm, so it's going to take me a lifetime to go through that anyway um, I also picked up because I want to do my nails and I picked up some nail polish remover. This was $2.25. So, and I, so I needed some, again, not dragging it back and forth. It's hard to remember everything that you're going to need 
at both places and dragging it back and forth and trying to remember what I brought here that I need to take home again. Too hard for me. At the end of the season, I'll just pack everything up and take it home, put it in a box and leave it there until it's time to bring it back in the spring again. So nail polish remover. Down the crafting aisle, I didn't get much again, like I said. I picked up this for $2. It is a little cup hook. I basically wanted it for these hooks. Um, yeah, so it's got three of the little brass hooks in, on it, and they're screw nailed in so you can take them off if you want to. But I needed a place to put my keys when I'm here at the camper anyway, so I can just hang this on the side of my shelf, and I will have a place to put my keys. I could redo this, too. I mean, this is an like an unfinished wood. This could be painted. This could all be trimmed out and painted and redone in the colors for your to your decor. And for $2, this is a, a good, heavy, substantial little piece. So I'm going to insert a clip here. I found a bunch of signs, too. So I haven't been to Dollarama for a couple of weeks. I don't think these signs were there the last time I was there. So I just took a little video to show them. I'm going to insert that here. These signs here, these day of the week signs, one says uh, weekly planner, the other one just says this week, and these are really great little signs. They could be used for so many things, and this one here, home where you treat your friends like family and your family like friends, this sign is really substantial, and it needs no DIYing. I love this kiss the cook. Uh, it looks like a hot plate trivet. There's the little house with the hooks on it that I got. And I really like this all you need is love sign. It was really pretty. The, I mean, Dollarama has upped their game with the signs recently. Um, there are a lot here. I love that home sweet home. There are a lot here that I wouldn't even DIY. Those signs were really cute. Um, I needed some crafting paint for a project to do here, so I picked up the Crafters Acrylic Black, the Cinnamon Brown, and the White. And if you watched my last little DIY thingy, I didn't have enough white paint, and I was almost out of black and not a whole lot of brown, so I, I grabbed those colors. These are the 4-ounce bottles. They're $1.50 a bottle. And then down the housekeeping aisle, I picked up some Febreze fabric refresher. This is $4 there. And some Dawn dish soap. So the Dawn dish soap is $2.50. I picked up a couple of mugs, guys. These were $2 a piece. They are Casa Moderna uh, brand. These ones right here. Are these pretty? These are just a nice sized little mug. I really like these. I picked up one in the kind of green aqua color and the yellow. And it's a flat paint. It's not the glossy like mugs usually are. I like these and I just thought that they would be nice to leave here at the camper. So that's my haul. A lot of this stuff this week was just um, functional stuff. This <laughs> and this were the only things that I got that weren't functional necessities. And with that being said, I'm going to round this video up. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe if you haven't done that already. I'll see everybody in the next video. Bye-bye for now, everyone.